Hey everyone, as promised, I am filming a resin haul video. I'm going to get straight to it. I'll start off with the boring stuff first, and that is a box of nitrile gloves. They're really important in resin because unlike polymer clay, it's a very toxic material. You do not want this in your on your skin, guys, because I heard the reactions can be pretty bad. Except I think I'm going to exchange this box because I don't know if you can see, but there is like a watermark there. A sti I, it's turning me off completely. I'm going to exchange it for a better box because I'm paranoid and I don't want my gloves to be dirty like that. I got a, another bag of respirators. It's from the same place. It's a local place here um, where I live. They sell a whole bunch of like equipment for construction and you just get be better deals because you're buying them in bulk. Some measuring cups. Um, because I'm quite foolish, I buy three instead of an even number of cups. Oh, whatever. I can always run to the store and get some more. Some wooden sticks for stirring. Um, I got some colorants for my resin. Again, this is... I don't know if I mentioned this, but this is one of the most expensive crafts I've ever experienced buying. Oh, that made no sense. But basically, I it was it's it's really easy to blow easily two hundred dollars just for half of your equipment. I still feel like I need more stuff. Um, and this one was really expensive because you only get um, what is this thirty mils for five bucks or six dollars it's really expensive but I really wanted white and I wanted several other colors but I'm broke <laughs> I don't have money to buy a whole bunch of colors but definitely um I'll think about it down the line because the thing is like I don't I'm not sure if I'll even like this craft so yeah I bought some glitters I really was tempted to buy the Martha Stewart glitters but again I didn't want to blow a lot of money especially starting out it's really important not to you know spend all your money because you never know if you'll like it or not here's the second one i i only bought this because look at this they have hearts and stars so pretty very gorgeous and flowers too oh i didn't even realize that pretty pretty look at that purple that purple is something else Wow. I could look at that all day. I got some. This was on clearance, so I was like, Meh, why not? Some tinsel glitter and blush by Recollections. I got some micro beads in bubblegum, I think. No, passion. And it might look like one color, but if you go closer. Whoa, that's trippy. Why is it doing that? Anyways. That's soup. Wow, my camera is really tripping right now. It doesn't look like that. It's actually like little balls, but it's making it look like holy or something. Anyways, you guys get the idea. Next, I thought of getting some molds. I went to sophieandtoffee.com. Uh, if you like resin, you will adore their site. They're, it's amazing. I was tempted to get every single mold on there, but I just stuck to the simple ones. Because I don't want to end up hating this and then having a bunch of equipment I'll probably never use. I got the shiny mold. It's the pink one. Every resin crafter has this. It's got every shape and size in there. So if you want to experiment and you're trying out, you don't... You can easily get this and try out different shapes instead of buying one mold full of hard shapes or one mold full of diamonds. It's just everything else on hand ready for you. And I wanted to buy something else. Um, and that, that was this chocolate one. It's so cute. Um, again, it's shiny on the inside, so that means your pieces will turn out shiny. And um, yeah. Sophie and Toffee, guys. Excellent. 
the last thing I got was my resin. I thought I had more. I got the Envirotex Light, 32 ounces, I believe. Oh, wait a minute. I don't know. Us Canadians don't stick to the ounce system. We use um, milliliters, so it's the... But I'm pretty sure this is the 32 ounce. It's heavy. Uh, and this one is the 946 milliliter bottle. Bottles. Whatever. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Uh, maybe you guys will see some resin tutorials. for. No, I shouldn't say tutorials because I'm not totally knowledgeable. I can't really give you guys any insight because I'm starting out. But maybe you'll see some craft updates from me that involve resin. Who knows? Uh, I'm excited. Oh my god, I totally forgot about the stickers. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. I was like, I spend so much money on this. How can this just be it? <laughs> Sorry guys, there's more to come. I found some pretty neat stickers here. That's another thing too. Like, the stickers are... It's so hard to find some decent epoxy stickers because because I'm starting out, I didn't want to spend a whole bunch of time sealing and stuff. Um, so I found some stickers here. And they're plastic, so I don't have to spend more time uh, sealing them with Mod Podge because I heard that was a pain. These are super cute. If, uh, this guy's my favorite. Look at him. He's like a pseudo-intellectual. I love it. <laughs> More kitties. And they're puffy too. Which I hope is not going to be a problem. But I heard they float. So, great. This is really cute. There's a kitty here on a cupcake. Pandas, of course. Aww. Um, some sheep. Sleepy time. Here is a sh sheet of stickers with a bunch of assorted animals. So we got a pig here, a dog, a bear, an iguana lizard thing, <laughs> a kitty, a squirrel, a panda. This is really cute. And I also wanted to get some Lisa Frank stickers. Um, this is so pretty. And it's so deceiving because it says, look, two, over 200 stickers, right? And I'm like, wow, that's a lot. And then I'm, I notice a book in there. So I'm like, wow, is that a book of stickers? No, guys, it isn't. Because if you open the package, you're like, wow, I'm excited. You open her up. And it's blank. There's nothing in here. Like, why would you... Ugh. Anyways. Apparently, there are two sheets in here. Let me just pull them out. And apparently, there are two more over 200 stickers in here. I don't know. So, there's 100 in here and 100 in here. I feel like I'm getting ripped off, but... There were only a few dollars, so I don't I don't really feel that bad. It looks like I have to seal these, though, unfortunately. Ugh. <laughs> but uh, I'm sure once I get the hang of it, I can do it. Look at these. These are so cute. Again, we got animals on cupcakes. Is that a trend? <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, I will see you guys in my next video. And don't forget to follow my social media links. They will all be in the down bar below. I'm pretty active on Instagram, so please talk to me on there. Talk to me on here. I have very few subscribers on here. I have 12 subscribers as of now. Thank you guys for sticking around and supporting me. And um, yeah, you guys are showing me love. And um, thank you so much for like being here and liking my stuff, commenting. Uh, you guys are awesome, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Have a great day. Bye.